So in working with word problems, it's really important that you go through and actually write the question out. And the reason that is because we're going to replace this step by step. All right, so the first thing I want to talk about is the word is. Whenever you see the word is, you can replace that with an equal sign. So we're going to slowly change the sentence from words into a number sentence, or in this case, an equation. So I say this is now equal to 54. The second piece I want to look at is this phrase, two times a number. Whenever you see this, it's two times our unknown variable, which we can go ahead and label any letter you want. I'm going to use X for this. So that's the second part. And then the next thing I want to talk about is what happens with this word sum. What this word sum means is that I am taking the next pieces here and wherever you see that and the word and, you replace it with a positive side. If it was the difference between them, then the and would become a negative side. But right now it's the sum. So that tells us we are going to add these two together. So now all of this translates to eight. I bring down my plus side because I'm adding the two next pieces together. So eight plus two times X is the same thing as two X is equal to 54. Now in your homework, they are gonna first ask you for the equation. You need to type this equation in uh, first. That's the first part of the question. Now, the second part is we're going to go ahead and solve that. So we're going to go ahead and solve that by subtracting 8 from both sides. And then I'm left with 2x is equal to 46. I divide both sides by 2. And my value of x is equal to 23. So again, there's two things that you have to input into this uh, for, the, uh, for, for your lesson, you have to put in the equation, and then you need to put in uh, the value of x. And do be careful, while for the first one, you need to input and type in the answer box, this entire thing, the next answer box says x is equal to, then they have the answer box. So the only thing that goes inside this is the 23. You do not put the X inside that answer box. We're going to do the same thing here. Um, we're going to start with the uh, equal piece because I always think that's important. So this is equal to uh, 52. So I have that part of the equation down. Now the next part says eight is subtracted from. That means it goes behind the next value. And two times a number, we've talked about that before, this just means two X. So to put this in order, it is two X, I subtract eight is equal to uh, 52. And that is the equation, and you type that entire thing into the equation. The next part, I want to go ahead and solve this equation. So I add 8 to both sides. And I'm left with 2x is equal to 60. I divide both sides by 2. And I'm left with x is equal to 30. And again, this is the answer to our question, and the way it's asking you to input the question is it's just asking you to put in uh, the 30. 